In between COVID-19 pandemic an outbreak of the avian influenza has affected millions of birds across many states of India. It was identified in the first week of January with reports of unusual deaths of large number of birds in one of the India state. Over 95% of them were migratory birds from Siberia and Mongolia. Avian influenza or commonly known as bird flu is a viral infection that infect not only birds but also humans and other animals. Most form of the virus are restricted to birds including those which are consumed by humans such as chickens, duck, turkey and quails. The wild and migratory birds act as a natural reservoir of these viruses and they bring these pathogens to poultry and other domestic birds through contact. H5N1 is the most common form of bird flu. It is deadly to birds and can easily affect humans and other animals that come in contact with the carrier. According to the World Health Organization, H5N1 was first discovered in humans in 1997 and has killed nearly 60% of those infected. Also, several other strains such as H7N9, H9N2 affects human too. In September 2016, India declared itself free from the virus. Unfortunately, the relief was short-lived. The first time Indian birds came down with the flu was in 2006, same year when countries across Asia, Africa and Europe saw an outbreak. But it had caused panic back in 2008 when 2 million chickens were killed. Since then, the disease kept resurfacing again and again. Now with another outbreak in 2021, officials are on high alert again. as there are chances that the virus could mutate and be fatal in humans so people are panicked government has banned the sale of poultry in many states this is why the poultry industry is facing massive losses also hundreds of vets and medical staff had to keep in isolation experts say that continuous growth of poultry farming under poor sanitary may have sustained the virus